Of the 31 verses in Proverbs chapter 11, there's a small word, a connecting word, uh, that appears 22 times. 22 times out of 31 verses, it's the word but. Uh, again and again, the writer here is going to compare and contrast uh, the upright with the wicked, uh, the righteous with the unrighteous. And again and again, um, the writer extols the blessings of being upright and being righteous. Um, it's a great, great chapter. So when you go back and read Proverbs chapter 11, look for that little word, but. For example, uh, even in verse 1, I'm reading, The Lord abhors dishonest scales, but accurate weights are his delight. So you get an answer. There's something that's bad or wrong or improper, but the writer's going to give you the good thing. Uh, one little verse today is verse 25. Uh, the generous person will himself prosper, and he who refreshes others will himself be refreshed. Um, I've stated earlier in the, in the Vespers that one of the greatest qualities of people of faith is the ability to be generous. Uh, a generous person will prosper. And he who refreshes others will himself be refreshed. Put your faith to action and practice some generosity. Look for the comparison and the contrast between the upright and the wicked in Proverbs chapter 11. God bless you. Have a good evening.